Okay. Okay, so background noise needs to stop. We're going live. I'll start it just a second if you want to Welcome to the afternoon session of our fifth grade spelling bee. So we're going to have each of the spellers from the fifth grade come up to the microphone and say their names. So speller number one. Raylan Connard. Colby Shrek. Davin Ford. Piper Ashley. Samantha Whistler. Jagger Mia. Without further ado. Camora, your word is cranky. Cranky. C R A N K Y. Davin, your word is career. I'm sorry, Kyle. Career. C A R R A R. I'm sorry, that's incorrect. The word is disease. Disease. D I S U E. Disease. I'm sorry, that's not correct. Your word is trophy. Trophy. T R O P H Y. Trophy. Athlete. Athlete. A T H L E T E. Athlete. Jotted. Jotted. J O T T E D. Jotted. This word is a homonym. Side. Side. Can I have a definition? You sure can. Released slowly and audibly a deep drawn breath, especially as the involuntary expression of weariness, dejection, grief, regret, longing, yearning, or relief. Side. S I G H E D. Side. Your word is duo. Duo. D U O. Repress. Uh, can you repeat the word? Repress. Repress. R E P R E S S. Repress. This word has a near homonym. Either. Can you put it in the same thing? Sure. Yeah. Oh, yeah. When faced with the two options, Maggie indicated that she had no interest in either. Either. E I T H E R. Rely. Rely. R E. L Y Rely. Chose. Chose. C H O S E. Chose. Else. Else. E L S E. Else. Antsy. Can I have a definition? Sure. Restless, fidgety. 
ANSI. A N T S Y, ANSI. This word has a homonym, Canada. Can you use that in a sentence? Sure. People from Canada have a subtle but delightful accent. Okay. Canada. C A N A D A. This word has a near homonym, bison. Bison. B I S O N. Dangerous. Dangerous. D A N G E R O U S. This word could be confused with a similar word. Pluck. Pluck. P L U C K. Pluck. Squid. Squid. S Q U I D. Squid. Frisbee. Frisbee. Capital F R I S B E E. Frisbee. This word has a homonym teeter. Can I have a definition? Sure. To move unsteadily. T teeter. T E E T E R. Teeter. This word has a homonym. Rallies. Um, can you use that in a sentence? Sure. Parvati hopes her school soccer team rallies before the time runs out. Okay. Rallies. R A L L I E S. Pastry. Pastry. P A S T R Y. Pastry. Coveralls. Can you use that in a sentence? The skilled car mechanic wore coveralls at work to protect his regular clothes. Coveralls. C O V E R A L L S. Ponytail. Ponytail. P O N Y T A I L. Ponytail. <clears throat> Clatter. Clatter. C L A T T E R. Clatter. This word could be confused with a similar word. Snout. Can I have a definition? The long projecting nose of any of various mammals, such as swine. Snout. S N O U T. Snout. Tumbling. Can I have a definition? Sure. The skill, practice, or sport of executing gymnastic feats of rolling and turning. Tumbling. T-U-M-B-L-I-N-G. Tumbling. Cradle. Cradle. C-R-A-D-L-E. Firefly. Can I have a definition? A winged, nocturnal light producing insect, usually producing a bright, soft, intermittent light without sensible heat by oxidation of luciferin. Firefly. F I R E F I R E. <laughs> Firefly. Sorry. The following word 
has two correct spellings. Either one of the two spellings listed below can be accepted. Humor. Humor. H U M O R. Mention. Mention. M E N T I O N S. Did she have S? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. That is incorrect. Okay. This word could be used confused with a similar word. Spoken. Spoken. S P O K E N. Spoken. <clears throat> This word could be confused with a similar word. Bridge. You have a definition? A structure built over a depression or an obstacle to travel, such as a river, chasm, roadway, or railroad, carrying a continuous pathway or roadway, as for pedestrians, automobiles, or trains. Bridge. B-R-I-D-G-E. Bridge. Pinpoint. Can I have a definition? To locate with great precision or accuracy. P pinpoint. P I N P O I N T. Pinpoint. This word could be confused with a similar word. Slate. Can I have um, a definition? A thin, flat slab, piece, or layer of laminated rock prepared in the shape of a shingle and used especially for roofing and siding, tile, shingle. Okay. Slate. S-L-A-T-E. Slate. Plush. Plush. P-L-U-S-H. Whimper. Can I have a definition? To make a low whining plaintive or broken sound. Whimper. W H I M P E R. Bracelet. Bracelet. B R A C E L E T. Bracelet. Inwardly. Inwardly. I N W A R D L Y. Inwardly. Mobility. Can I have a definition? The capacity or facility of movement. Movability. Mobility. M O B I L I T Y. Mobility. Eddie. Um, can you do that in a sentence? Sure. Audrey dropped leaves into the stream's eddy and watched them swirl. Can I have a definition? A current of air or water running contrary to the main current, especially one moving circularly. Eddie. E-D-D-I-E. -D -D that is incorrect. I'm sorry. Fanged. Can I have a definition? Sure. Having or resembling the long, sharp teeth by which the prey of an animal is seized and held or torn. Fanged. F A N G E D. Correct. This word has a homonym. Bow. Can you use it in a sentence? Sure. The huge bow just barely missed landing on mom's new car. Can I have a definition? A branch of a tree. B-O-W-N. Sorry, that is incorrect. Cautioned. Cautioned. C-A-U-T-I-O-N-E-D. Cautioned. Accuse. 
Accuse. A C C U S E. Accuse. Drowsy. Can I have a definition? Sure. Ready to fall asleep? Sleepy. Drowsy. D R O W S Y. Drowsy. Scoff. Can I have a definition? Sure. To show contempt by derisive acts or language, to speak contemptuously or with ridicule or mockery. Scoff. S-C-O-F. Scoff. That is incorrect. That is incorrect. I'm sorry. This word could be confused with a similar word. Opposite. Opposite. O-P-P-O-S-I-T-E. Opposite. Instrument. Instrument. I N S T R U M E N T. Instrument. Blissfully. Could I have a definition? In a manner full of, marked by, or causing bliss. Very happy. Blissfully. B L I S-S-F-U-L-L-Y. Activists. Activist. Uh, before you say that, activists, per plural. Okay. Activists. A-C-T-I-V-I-S-T-S. -S. Activists. Correct. Commute. Commute. C O M M U T E. Commute. This word has a homonym. Cocoa. Can I have a definition? A beverage prepared by cooking chocolate powder with water or milk. Cocoa. C O C O A. Cocoa. Correct. Nutrients. Nutrients. N U T R I E N T S. Nutrients. Scarcely. Scarcely. S C A R C E L Y. Scarcely. Stretcher. Can I have a definition? Sure. A litter usually made of canvas stretched on a frame for carrying injured or dead per persons. Stretcher. S T R E T C H E R. Stretcher. This word has a homonym, layers. Layers, L-A-I-R-S, layers. This word has a homonym, mustard. Can I have the definition? Sure. A pungent yellow condiment consisting of the pulverized seeds of the plant of the same name, either dry or made into a paste, as with water or vinegar, and sometimes adulterated with other substances as turmeric or mixed with spices. Mustard. M U S T A R D. Mustard. This word has a homonym cruel. Can I have a definition? Sure. Stern, rigorous, and grim. Unrelieved by leniency or softness. Cruel. C R U E L. Cruel. This word has a near homonym. 
Goblins. Goblins. G O B L I N S. Goblins. Unnoticed. Unnoticed. U N N O T I C E D. Unnoticed. Lento. Can I have a definition? In a slow manner, I'm sorry, in a slow manner used as a direction in music. Can you use it in a sentence? Sure. Mrs. Londesco pointed out that the passage was marked Lento, but unfortunately Giselle kept rushing through it. Lento. L-E-N-T-O. Lento. Scandinavia. Scandinavia? Mm -hmm. S C A N D A N A V I A. Sorry, that is incorrect. This word has a near homonym. Opus. Opus. O P U S. Opus. Pedestrian. Can I have a definition? One walking as distinguished from one traveling by car or cycle. Can you use it in a sentence? Only a pedestrian can access the streets in the old part of town, which are still cobbled and extremely narrow. Pedestrian. P E D E S T R I A N. Pedestrian. Snorkels. Is it is it plural? Snorkels. S N O R K E L S. Snorkels. Lullaby. Can you use it in a sentence? When Emma looked down into the baby's still open eyes, it became clear that the lullaby was not working. Lullaby. L U L L A B L Y Lullaby. I'm sorry, that's not correct. Right. Dabbing your word is Fortran. Fortran. Capital F, capital O, capital R, capital T, capital R, capital A, capital N. Fortran. That's the 15th round. That would be easy. Okay. Yeah. That's All right. Yeah, okay. Congratulations, Feller. <laughs> so if we could please bring up our top three spellers. So in third place, we have Colby Shrek. Nice job, Colby. Congratulations. In second place, we have Piper Ashley. Congratulations, Piper. And in first place, we have Davin Ford. Congratulations, Davin. All right. If you guys want to get together, so Mrs. I can't get it up. You don't have my face. What the heck? <laughs> All right, so just everybody has masks up. Okay. Very good. Congratulations, you guys. We'll have some documents printed up for you guys later. Thank you to all of you. You did an excellent job. I'm super proud of you. Your palms are
interrupt, and I can get. Hi. And let him introduce himself at the mic. Okay, we're gonna start our final round for our spelling bee. So I'm gonna let the sixth graders introduce themselves. Noah. Okay. I'm Noah Pinson, and I like pizza with mushrooms. You don't have to state what you like, just your name. Oh, I didn't. Now I want to. I didn't. Okay, hi, I'm Maya Hopper. I'm Rowdy Eggs. <laughs> I'm Lily Lockhart. I'm Vivian Meyer. I'm Brandon Weiss. I'm Kimber Pettigrew. I'm Ellison Lozenby. I'm Reese McDaniel. Your word is Snorkel. S N O R K L E S. Your word is tangents. Tangents. T A N G E T S. Tangents. Sorry, that is incorrect. Expression. Expression. E X P R E S S I O N. Expression. Violin. Violin. V I O L I N. Semicolon. Semicolon. S E M I C O L O N. Semicolon. This word has a near homonym. Patent. P A T E N T. Incantations. I N. Pull your mask down here. I N C A N T A T I O N S. Ventured. Ventured. V E N T E R E D. Sorry, that is incorrect. This word has a near homonym Feta. Feta. F E T T A. Feta. Proverb. Proverb. P R O V E R B. Proverb. This word could be confused with a similar word. Indecipherable. Indecipherable. I N D E C I P H E R A B L E. Podium. Podium. P O D I U M. Podium.
Aztec. A Z T E C. Laboratory. L A B R A T O R Y. Sorry, that is not correct. Sinister. Sinister. S I N I S T E R. Sinister. This word could be confused with a similar word, run. R U N E S. Ancestors. Ancestors. A N C E S T O R S. Ancestors. Convulsive. C O N V O L S I V. I'm sorry, that is not correct. Detergent. Detergent. D E T E R G E N T. Sheep. Sheep. S H E I T H. I'm sorry, that is not correct. Streamlet. Streamlet. S T R E A M L I T. Streamlet. Sorry, that is not correct. So wait a second. They also they get to come back in. Is that or if you would have to spell this one correctly? Right. Okay. <laughs> Congratulate. Congratulate. C O N G R A D U L A T E. Sorry, that's incorrect. So we'll redo that one. Oh. Correct. <laughs> Start with Lily. Can you point me somewhere or did we start? Okay. Yeah. Start so start back with Gabby. Yes. I'm sorry about that. Start back with Gabby. Okay. Paper time. 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 in their original order, so we're back to Thank you. Okay. Thank you for that. Scallion. Scallion. S-C-A-L-L-I-O-N. Scallion. This word is a near homonym. Hurdle. H U R T L E. Intoxicating. Intoxicating. I N T O X I C A T I N G. Porcupine. Porcupine. P O R C U P I N E.
This word could be confused with a similar word. Ineffective. Ineffective. I-N-A-F-F-E-C-T-I-V-E. -F -F -E. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Trough. T R O F trough. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. This word has a homonym. Leech. Leech. L E A C H. So now he does. Okay, this word has a homonym, wrath. Wrath? Wrath. Um, use any sentence, please. Zeus' wrath was legendary on Mount Olympus, and the other gods knew to stay away from him when he was upset. Wrath. W-R-A-T-H, wrath. That's nice job, guys. So congratulations to our sixth grade finishers. So in third place was Lily Lockhart. Come on up. In second place was Vivian Meyer. Come on up. And in first place was Mr. Rowdy Yanks. Come on up. See if you guys can do this. Do Mrs. Voice Arts class.